National Rosé Day is coming up this Saturday, and there's no better way to kick it off than with some signature <laughs> drinks from award-winning mixologist and cocktail expert, Pam Withnitzer. Welcome back, hey, Pam. Hey, Pam! Lucas has already started drinking. Yeah, yeah. Pam. 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 You always make our morning and then our entire day. I, that's yeah. what I try to do, set the tone now so you're ready to go for later. All right, so you're gonna make us a drink. You mind if I join you? Yeah, come right. on over. Oh, um, yes. And while we're making a drink so over good. there, <laughs> you guys are, I, I saw it, like you guys just going for yeah, it. Right they just that down. Yeah, this is so good. It's so good. I always remember when Pam arrives, yeah. but I never remember seeing her leave. Yeah. <laughs> Me too. Yeah. It's very, it very gets weird. so fuzzy. Um, so just to go over that sangria, so I opened up a new bar called The Look Up here in New York City, and Woo. this is our rose sangria that we served by the pitcher on the roof. Wow. So it's really great. Um, so we're using the Hampton Water Rose. It's award winning Ooh. rose by Jesse Bon Jovi, son of yes. John Bon Jovi. Uh, and it's phenomenal because it's nice and dry and crisp. It goes with some Aperol, a uh, strawberry infused brandy, a little bit of rose hip syrup, and lemon juice all together with some fresh fruit. So yeah. keep drinking. There's I could more. I'll pitch it to myself. Oh, there's honestly. another pitcher? Sounds I mean, amazing. There could be. Oh, <laughs> there's yeah. just that picture for right I love now. What are you making for me? Possibilities. I love this so much. I think I love when you come up here because yeah. you're like, you're gonna put me out of a job, I swear. I'm not gonna be a Let bartender me shake something. So I know we've done such a great job of shaking. Thank oh. you all those times, but today we're blending. Level up. Uh, level up. <laughs> um, I think Frosé has been such a huge craze, but you can also make a drink that's a little, got a little more punch okay. and also accents a lot of great things about Rosé. Uh, so today we're gonna kind of make a play on a margarita. Mm, you, you like agave base drinks? I love tequila, yes. Yeah. So uh, we're gonna make a nice drink. Uh, we're gonna use a little bit of mezcal to bring a bit of smokiness into that. So this is Sombra. Comes from one of the most sustainable distilleries down in Mexico. Okay. So we're gonna put that into our blender. That's amazing. Don't worry, you're gonna. Is that for one or two? That's me for two, because okay. we have some more guests coming on today. <laughs> Just check it. All right, and then we're gonna use El Corlejo over here. We're gonna use two ounces of that into our blender as well. So we're gonna get a nice little kick out of that. Um, and you might be saying, Pam, where's the rosé, right? Yeah, where's the rosé, Pam? We made a syrup. Ooh. Yeah. Right? Wow. So like uh, we took the- Michelangelo paint. Really. What is that, Lucas? Like watching Michelangelo paint. <laughs> it really is. Almost as close as that. Uh, we have the Madalena here, which comes from an incredible winery up uh, in upstate California. Uh, it's nice, it's got beautiful color too, which will yeah. part into the drink. So we're gonna use a nice healthy pour of that. We're gonna use 1.5 ounces and then fresh- Fresh. Fresh lime juice, because I'm not gonna let you have anything less than that. And What's a little uh, pitcher fun without some fruit, right? Yes. Yep. So tis be the season. I know <laughs> you guys get ready for this. Raspberries. Some raspberries, oh right? <gasps> Put that in there, heighten the pink. Oh, this is, I'm already in love with this drink. Yeah. So what I would love you to help me with is can we get some ice in yes. here? I can do that. So you need Maybe. a healthy amount of ice that's gonna come Maybe into the pitcher. Hand. Yeah. <laughs> sure, it's, we all washed our hands beforehand. I did. <laughs> I really did, actually. Yeah, and you're gonna really wanna um, add ice in there because it's gonna add dilution and also the frozen element in there. So gotcha. that, that even more. A little bit more, and we're gonna okay. be ready to go. All right, this gets loud. But okay. guys, I think during the blending time, we need a little bit of a blending dance, right? Oh, so okay, sure. When I, when I hit it, everyone's gonna go for it. Ready? Yeah. One, okay. two, three. Dancing, they cut to a close up with a blender. They were like, We really don't like it. <laughs> yeah, they're like, Those are all off for them. <laughs> all right, and if you want, we have two really yes. great glasses here. I can hold them if you'd like yeah, four. You Actually, yeah, that's, that's where that. your bartending skills come in. So, I want one of those. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh. It's just really nice. And the fun so thing is good. that you can always change it up. You can always change up the fruit. Uh, you know, you can add a different citrus, yeah. the main spirit, but the really fun thing about rosé is it can be like really versatile in the drink. Um, and if you don't think that's enough rosé, can you, you know, top it off? You can just like top it off with a little extra oh on the top. Oh my gosh. Right. You just are like spoiling Whoa. us. This is so, the things that make me cry. <laughs> yeah. This is why we like, love having this you here. a driving seat. Yeah, so just a little <laughs> bit more, just for some fun. And then some straws, because it's not gonna be a fun drink unless you have reusable, washable, Hard plastic Woo! straws, right? Woo! So that's me for you. Yes, yeah, take it on over. Oh my God! Ah, I, need to I can't try find that. the straw. Wow, that looks. <laughs> that was beautiful. Uh, I wow, can't wait Pam, to have you're this. Such an this artist. one's for our guests when she comes out. Really? <laughs> I think so. <laughs> no, but I'm gonna, gonna have melt. Extra straw for you. It's you totally want. gonna melt. I don't think our guest needs to drink. <laughs> <laughs> uh -oh. Thank you, Pam. That was so of much. Of course, there Thank you go. And happy Rosé Day. Oh. And to learn more about Pam and her cocktails, head to Twitter and follow at Pam with Snitzer for more information.